31 Texas state parks are in the path of totality for the April 8th solar eclipse, including right here at Pernellis Falls State Park. But if you're hoping to view it from here, you'll need more than just eclipse glasses. I highly recommend making reservations ahead of time. If you wanted to camp at a Texas state park, reservations open back on November 7th, and it's probably too late. Here at Pernellis Falls, regular campsites will be closed for construction starting April 1st. We'll be moving on before then, but uh, I mean, a spot like this, it has such natural splendor, it'd be a perfect spot to capture that. Luckily, you still have time to get a day pass. Those reservations will be available starting March 8th at 8 a.m. And you can make those reservations online, over the phone, and with the reservation in hand, you are guaranteed a spot. Park interpreter Stephen Garman says extra staff and volunteers will be here to make the viewing extra special. So we're going to be having several telescopes uh, manned by the Austin Astronomical Society. They'll be equipped with solar filters like this one. It filters out most of the, the bright uh, uh, sun, sunlight coming through and uh, makes it safe for you to look even through a magnified lens. And here's what you'll see. It is a once in a lifetime event in which the sun literally goes out and uh, the entire uh, area is put into shadow, into shade. The moon passes between the sun and earth, completely blocking the face of the sun. Maximum totality in Texas is 4 minutes and 28 seconds. Here at Pertinellis Falls, it's supposed to be lasting for 3 minutes and 54 seconds. Starting at 1.34 p.m. and ending at 1.38. That's more than 2 minutes longer than in Austin. So, I mean, imagine being one of the lucky few to be here to experience that. Capacity is limited to a few hundred parking spots, and once reservations are sold out, you're out of luck. Parking lots are going to be busy, but if you hike out to a spot like this or anywhere along any of our 40 miles of trails, you'll probably find some place to, to have a really uh, peaceful view of the eclipse. So plan ahead, plan for traffic, and hope the weather cooperates. If it's cloudy on eclipse day, we'll be a, a lot of disappointed rangers, but we'll still be in a beautiful place like Pedernales Falls to enjoy hiking or whatever you'd like to do here. Near Johnson City, I'm Chicago Windler, CBS Austin News.